We've been waiting for years, but finally it looks like King's Dominion will be getting a new roller coaster in 2018. So before we go rambling about B&Ms and crap like that, we need to think about this. Is Hurler getting arm seed in 2018? And I think the answer is yes. My first reason is, look, a picture of an arm seed truck at Hurler. What happened last time we saw an RMC truck at a Cedar Fair Park? Oh, <laughs> RMC mean streak is happening. Okay, well, we now have one reason to believe that Hurler is getting RMC'd for 2018. But now we have another question up floating around up there in the air somewhere. Why has RMC mean streak been under construction for so long already, and Hurler is just now getting started? Well, that's because mean streak is big. Hurler is not big at all. So, because of that, they had to get started on mean streak a lot earlier almost a year and a half before it's going to even open. Earlier, they're just now starting to tear it apart a little bit, strip down some track maybe, some of the structure. Here's a picture of track piled up behind a fence at King's Dominion. Now, I've been told that this could be track from the actual hurler, but it could be RMC track. As you can tell, it's very dark, and you can't tell what it is. I tried zooming in and looking at it. It didn't help at all. It just made the picture blurry because it's dark, and zooming in doesn't work very well. So... That picture's not going to help, but there's some sort of track laying behind that fence. We don't know what it is. Wait a minute. Look at this picture. What do these have in common? That's RMC track at Hurler. Here's my proof. Okay, so look really closely in this picture. Do you see that power cord going up in the air there in front of the track? And then you see a cone right there, right? So there's a cone and a power cord, and then there's track behind it. Now look at this. All right, so here we have some RMC track just sitting up there at the top. That is maroon colored eyebox track similar to the mean street color and now if you look at the bottom we have a red circle and a blue square inside that red circle is the cone that we saw in the previous picture in that blue square is the uh, electric wire and the power pole we saw in the previous picture let's go back yep power cord cone rmc track and here we are zoomed in even further that red arrow is the cone that blue arrow is the power pole and cord and that blows black arrows up there that's the track so, yeah, these are real pictures of track at Hurler. So now that we figured out that this is, is most likely getting arm seed, let's look at the possibilities of the layout or some elements or something like that because that's what we do here. So I found this photo on Google, and it is someone who made up their own layout, and I think it looks fantastic, and I think it is actually possible. The only thing I want to talk about is that drop. If you notice, they drew an S shape instead of the turnaround of the drop. And I think that could be possible. Um, it would be cool if it was like a double down, like a, a bank double down. Right here they have two barrel rolls as a, as the drop. That doesn't seem legit. It could work, but I think a double down would be really cool. We've never really had like a coaster, a modern coaster with a drop having a double down. It would be really cool if Mean Streak ended up having a double down drop. That would be so cool, but it doesn't. And here's the reason why I think we may actually get to have this drop going this direction. Yeah, so if you look here, you can pretty much tell that not only is the track stripped at the bottom, all of the structure's gone at the bottom of the drop. So that's why I think they might be doing something else other than that turn. So I think that guy's drawing is very cool. If you happen to be watching, let me know it's yours, and I'll be sure to put your credit or whatever in the description, but I have no idea where the heck that came from. So at the moment, it's anonymous. Oh, one more last thing. You guys may be wondering why the color of this track is the same as the RMC Mean Street track. Well, if you noticed, all the Six Flags RMC's track are basically all the same color. Maybe some are a little different, like shaded a little different. And even some other RMC's, like Storm Chaser. That's, well, yeah, other RMC, Storm Chaser. <laughs> uh, except for Joker, that's the only one in Six Flags that is not red. So maybe Cedar Fair is going to make all their RMC's maroonish. So that's interesting. So, sorry I was so quiet in this video, it's really late, and I don't want to wake anyone up, but this video had to be made as soon as possible. So thank you guys so much for watching, be sure to destroy that like button, and destroy that subscribe button even more, because we're going to get to 750 by April 18th. That's less than a month, that's 18 days. Okay, 19 days, because that's my birthday. That's my birthday present, get us to 750 subs. Tristan's birthday is on April 3rd, so we're going to surprise him because he's probably not going to watch this video all the way through because he doesn't like listening to me talking. And let's get to 1,000 by May 31st, the channel's anniversary. So like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all later. Bye.